Horns up and welcome to a brand new episode of Headbangers Kitchen. I am back with some keto recipes for you guys and today I am going to be cooking up a keto shepherd's pie. Well not so much a shepherd's pie, let's call it a cottage pie because that's what I believe they call it when you use beef instead of lamb. Now we don't get lamb in India, we get mutton and I don't have any mutton at home so I am making it with beef today. You can make it with lamb or mutton or chicken, your choice. Now a normal shepherd's pie has got carrots and peas in it which I am going to be replacing with mushrooms and spinach and it also has a layer of creamy mashed potatoes on top which I am going to be replacing with cauliflower. Now I know what you are thinking, cauliflower? Ugh. Trust me guys, it's going to rock, it's going to be amazing, you won't even tell the difference. So let's go and make that keto shepherd's pie, I mean cottage pie, lest the purists come after me. Now for the creamy cauliflower mash, all you are going to need is some cooked cauliflower. You can boil this, you can steam it, you can even put it in the microwave like I did for about 5 minutes and you just want the cauliflower to be tender. So the first thing we are going to do is put the cauliflower in our blender or food processor. Then we are going to add a nice chunk of butter, some salt, some pepper and then blitz it. Now if your cauliflower is not steaming hot, just melt the butter before you put it in. Remember to scrape down the sides as well and keep blitzing. Then we are going to add in 2 egg yolks for some rich creamy mash and give it another blitz. Finally we are going to add some freshly grated parmesan cheese and then blitz it again. And then we have our creamy mash all ready and set to go. Now to get the meat ready we are going to put some butter and olive oil in our pan and we are going to get the butter to melt. The reason we do this is so that the butter doesn't burn. Next we are going to add in our onions and fry them till we start to get some color on them. I am going to add in some garlic as well and fry that. Then we add in our beef and we are going to cook that till we get some nice color on it and make sure you break it up, nothing worse than a lumpy shepherd's pie. Then I'm going to add in one beef stock cube, some Worcester sauce, some tomato puree, some powdered rosemary and some thyme and I'm going to give it a good mix. Next we add in our spinach and don't worry if it looks like a lot it's going to all wilt and become quite a little bit. So once the spinach is cooked we're going to add in our mushrooms and a pinch of salt and pepper and mix that in as well. And again the mushrooms are going to release their water and shrink in size. Once that's done, we're going to add some water, cover it and cook it for about 10 minutes and our meat is ready. Next, we're going to put that in our baking tray. And then we cover that meat with our delicious creamy cauliflower mash. I'm going to sprinkle some parmesan cheese over that and then we put it in an oven at 200 degrees to bake for about 20 minutes and our shepherd's pie or I mean our cottage pie is ready. Oh our keto cottage pie is ready. Look at that. That looks delicious. And our keto shepherd's pie, I mean our cottage pie is ready and it's time for you guys to taste it now. I've said this before and I'll say it again, if you want to be on the show just let me know because you know what, there's no point in just me eating this alone. You guys watch the show, you make the show happen so thank you all for watching and in return I'd like to feed you all. So if you're ever in Bombay, hit me up, if I'm shooting come and taste the food. Anyway, time to taste now. Hi, my name is Pratika and I'm a music consultant, Headbangers Kitchen Rocks. Uh, hi, I'm Ankit Gupta. I'm a photographer and Headbangers Kitchen Rocks. Hi, I'm Manupam. I'm a sound engineer. I love Headbangers Kitchen and everything that I cooks. And uh, I cannot wait to taste this beef shepherd uh, pie. Mm -hmm. Oh, good. Wow, what well, is cauliflower? Who's this? That's cauliflower. Oh wow, I would have never guessed. What have you done to this? You've got a bit stupid. Doesn't feel like cauliflower. Whatever it is, it's damn good. Wow, it, like this cauliflower tastes like like well mashed potato or something. So I think it compensates really well for potato. 
This is Judy Nice, by the way. This is Judy Nice. Mmm. Really good. So good. Wow. This is Dhanu. I think I lost finish now. Very nice. Fantastic. Can I eat all of this? Yeah, it's all for you. Yeah! Woo! Wow. You ain't getting this motherfucker. Hey guys, so I really hope you enjoyed that episode of Headbangers Kitchen and I will be back soon with another keto recipe. As always, please give the video a thumbs up, leave me a comment below, share this video on Facebook and if you are feeling even more generous and want to support us, buy a Headbangers Kitchen t-shirt. So till the next episode, cheers and keep cooking. I am Anupam. I, I I fucking hate this dude. Can I just? Okay. Sorry. Yeah. It's probably because of the associate. I mean, it's like I say, it's fine. Hi, I'm Anupam. I'm a sound engineer. I love Headbangers Kitchen and everything that Sahil cooks. And I cannot wait to taste a keto recipe of uh, pork sarputer. I mean, no, what is it? Beef sarputer. Fuck yeah. <laughs> huh? There's no sarputer. It's a shepherd's pie. Okay, fine. A beef shepherd's pie then. Achha, okay, now just give me the thumbs up. No, I'm, I'm too busy. Fuck your thumbs up. Fuck your thumbs up. How about a smile at least? <laughs> cool. Do you not see the smile on my face when I started eating this? Yeah, but like a sign of smile is what I needed. I know you're doing that deep right now. It's so nice. Hi, I'm Anupam. Uh, I'm a sound engineer. Okay, okay. Can you stop this for a minute?